what's up everybody and welcome back to my youtube channel if you are new hi there join us join us as you can see i look a little bit weird at the moment got one eye done other one not done today i was messing around with makeup trying something new i saw this look on pinterest and i wanted to give it a try mine obviously came out a little bit different <laughs> this is what i've got done now I'm going to attempt to do it on the other eye. So not only was this a challenge and took me like an hour to do, but now I'm going to try to get it exactly the same. Wish me luck. Well, good luck with that. I'm ready. Let's begin. I'm going to show you exactly how I did it. If you want me to try some other looks that you've seen on the internet, Instagram, Pinterest, whatever, you can send them to me and I'll be happy to try them. <laughs> so. I first started with the pink. I went with this palette. So let's go straight into that. I'm going to be using this dark pink. <laughs> Getting this exactly the same. I don't know if I can do it, guys. But I'm going to try. For you, I'm showing you this. Maybe you can recreate it. Um, let's try. I started by putting the pink all around my eye. Anybody notice how big this lash is? It's the first time I'm ever wearing such big lashes. I kind of like it, but I also feel like every time I blink, I'm going to blow someone away. Whee! Now I'm just going to plan out more or less where my wing is going to go. This very, very long wing that um, took me actually a very, very long time to get there. <laughs> I feel like I'm being optimistic trying to recreate this on the other side. So if I do it, I'm gonna be really impressed with myself. You feel like I do right now. Don't say you're on the run. To... I'm gonna go straight into liquid liner. I'm going to be using this liquid liner. And now let's just color in my whole eye. <laughs> The reason I say this is going to be a challenge is because my eyes are already a little bit different. Like, not in a noticeable way, but I notice it. Like, they're slightly different. And to get them to look exactly the same with such a delicate and precise look, I don't know if I can do this. But I believe in myself. I can do this. I can do this. Just do it! And is it just me or is almost every single person who does makeup on Instagram or Pinterest or YouTube or whatever, everybody's got such a perfect eyelid. No wrinkles, no bumps or lumps or anything. Am I weird? Do I have a normal eye? Like, I'm not sure. Like, my eyes are pretty wrinkly i think that's normal and i think that we shouldn't look at these pictures on instagram where we see all these girls with these flawless eyes because i mean editing exists i i do realize that but i think we all need to come to the realization that we don't have perfect eyes and our eyes aren't always exactly the same and that's fine we can still make some really cool looks out of it I don't know why it seems like it's a little bit easier this time. I don't want to jinx it, <laughs> but that just went on like so much easier. What the heck? You say you wanna try, but you never do. I am not a professional, clearly. This is all about me playing with makeup, having fun with it, and doing what makeup was made for i think we really need to get back into just enjoying playing with makeup and that's what i'm gonna do if it looks ugly so what i'm having fun i'm trying i'm getting creative and that's what this is all about don't you think so it may be ugly it may look weird it may not suit my eye shape but you know what i'm gonna learn and whoever wants to come with me on this journey 
hit subscribe and like. Join us, join us. <laughs> I, I, I need help. I think I should throw in there that I've never tried doing a look like this. If it's ugly, I'm sorry. I kind of like it and I don't think I'm doing that bad. Just a little ugly. Sugar, there's a reason why we lose. You say you wanna cry, but you never do. Sugar, there's a It needs more. Put some more. Put some more. Some more. Put some more. Now I'm going to put some highlights on the brow, so I'm going to dip into some concealer, my go-to concealer, NARS, and I'm just going to put some on the edge of this little brush, and I'm going to go right underneath the brow, and then I'm going to put highlight on. For the highlighter, I'm going to be using my MAC highlighter. The shade is Double Gleam. I want instant shine. Give me instant shine. Now I'm going to use some mascara. I'm going to use Maybelline Hyper Curl. I think that we are ready for the lash. Let's put it on. Let me just show you how big this thing actually is. It could be like a little goatee. <laughs> Why am I like this? I don't know. I got these from a friend who ordered them online for me. I'm not sure where she got them or what brand it is or anything like that. I just said thank you and took them. You know what's great about lashes? Is even if the look is horrid and comes out looking worse than you ever could have imagined, pop on a good lash and I promise you it fixes everything. I mean, some of you might look at this and think, ew, what is that? But then when you put the lash on, you're like, wow, it's actually kind of pretty. <laughs> Lashes solve anything. Wait a minute, did you say anything? Anything. Anything. Yes, anything. <laughs> anything. 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 I'll get you and I'll look like a bloody accident. And they're on. Yay! Now I'm going to set everything with the setting spray that I bought recently by Huda Beauty. I bought it from Sephora. Okay, directions. After applying makeup. Hold eight inches away and mist face two to four times in a circular motion. Keep eyes and mouth closed. Avoid applying directly on eyes and lips. Doesn't that go without saying? Huda's trick. Dampen beauty sponge with the formula and press into the face to seal in makeup for the day. Okay, I think I'm just gonna spray it on. Wait, how far is eight inches? Guys, I come from South Africa. I don't work in inches. Well, I'm just gonna hold it like this far away. I mean, it feels, feels nice. It smells good. It smells like cherries, I think. Mmm, it's sweet. You can feel the stickiness almost instantly, but I think it's doing what it's supposed to. It's not cheap, but it smells good. <laughs> is it worth it? I don't know. I just like trying new things. Oh. It is what it is. It is. And we're finished! What do we think of the complete look? It may not be perfect, but I'm pretty happy with how it came out. I think I got them kind of the same, and I quite like how the pink and the silver go together. I don't think it's bad for a first try. <laughs> what do you think? Let me know down in the comments. So that is it for today. If you guys want me to do any other looks and if you have any other ideas, please let me know down in the comments and I'll be happy to do that for you. Also, I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. My boyfriend said that if I hit a certain amount of subscribers, he'll let me do his makeup. <laughs> and he's never let me do that before. So please help me get there by liking and subscribing and I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye. Should say